Hi everyone, Justin here. Hi, I feel like it's necessary to explain a little bit about what's gonna go on in this video that you're watching. It's me and the guys arriving to fly fishing camp on the Kennebec River and the northern part of the river. It's a great fishery up here. This part of the river is very clear and clean and cold. It supports a lot of trout and landlocked salmon. There's rainbow trout, brown trout, brook trout, landlocked salmon. We're here fly fishing for those species. There's going to be a lot of salmon caught and some trout caught while we're here. And that's all to come in future videos on the Spike Skills YouTube channel. So you're going to want to click subscribe so you'll be notified of all the future videos uploaded on this channel. You know, the next several videos are going to be about our fly fishing action and four wheeling and side by side action up in the, up in the mountains and trails in northwestern Maine or somewhere around the Kennebec River. And you won't want to miss all that. So subscribe if you haven't done already. Hit that like button for me too if you could. Helps boost the algorithm for the Spike Skills YouTube channel. It pushes our videos out further to get more impressions. And so yeah, smash that like button. Click subscribe if you haven't already. Greatly appreciate it. And so in this video, it's me and the guys arriving to fly fishing camp. We're arriving to, you know, we're unloading, unpacking, getting gearing up getting ready to hit that river. And also in this video, Jason's explaining how we should approach the river, like where we should go to fish. And he's kind of sharing some tactics with us on how we should go about our fly fishing here on this river. And he's, Jason's also showing us where he's caught and had some luck in the past catching some salmon and trout. And we're a really good fly fisherman. He knows this river in and out and he catches a lot of good fish. Jason explains to us where he's caught some big ones. It's just right out in front of where we're staying, actually. The fishing is really, really good right where we are, like just out in front of the camp where we're staying. So we couldn't ask for anything more. Hey, man. How's it going? Let's go in and check out the cabin. Nice and cool in there. I think everyone would rather watch you. Nobody wants to watch me. I'm pulling out a cooler that I'm not going to be able to pick up on my phone. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about it. It's good. It's fine. Hey. Here's what I was hey. waiting to see. <laughs> the other one's the food one. Flip it right here. I'm going to check out the cabin. Oh, wait. That's backwards. We've got a new addition here. It was Jeff what? <laughs> Mark. I mean, Mark, yeah. Mark, Mark Jeff. I'm, I'm horrible. <laughs> Not even close. Well, remember what I did? <laughs> Not even close. Skip? Skip? What, what did I call him? Oh, what did you call him? But you're Mark. Yes. Cool. Say hi to I, I forget what I, I was calling him like. Uh, <laughs> Not Skip. Crap, I don't remember what it was. It was funny though. And it was every. Every time, too. This is the other beer cooler. Yeah. Ooh. That's we don't have any food. We're going to have to catch fish for yeah. food. we got plenty of beer, though. This is what we're going to catch right here. Is this a... Uh, would this be a brookie carving or a uh, brown? Probably brookie. It looks like square. The thing. brown wood kind. The yes. brown wood kind. The water... I've never seen the water this low. Don't, oh, go there. There for, don't go there for a while. <laughs> what? You couldn't... Couldn't wait, could you? No, nope, not at all. <laughs> well, here's our camp. Huh. Cozy little cottage. Oh yeah, it does stink. Job skip. Now you smell that all night. Because of allergies, no smoking of any kind inside this cabin. This includes medical. Violators will be billed a seventy-five dollar cleaning fee. There's my snacks. I brought my own. Before. Uh, it is like but some. didn't you unload two other vehicles into yours? Yes. You had yes. to. G so you you double, triple handled yeah. all. Oh yeah. All this stuff today, yeah. just this morning. Yep. See, so you're ready for a nap, right? Skip, skip. Uh, oh hell no. Chip. 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 It was it was it. Chip. Chip. Changed any other. <laughs> Let's go, Chip. <laughs> Chang, that's what it was. I worked the overnight last night. I'll probably. Take I took a nap while driving here. That's good. <laughs> I took a, it might I not be the safest, but I was two birds. I saw it double lanes. I was in the middle. <laughs> the pines. So they call this this cabin's called the Pines. Yep, this is the big cabin. So they they've got them. Each of them are named. Yep. This one. This is the big. And this is the cabin. bigger. Oh, it has an upstairs. Yeah, that's where we're gonna be sleeping. 
Sweet. Oh, it's gonna be hot up there. We got a fan. Uh oh, let's go jump in the river. <laughs> oh, we will. I'm all. <laughs> I can't wait to float it. That one's mine. That's your. Okay. Huh. <clears throat> Welcome to the pines. Sweet. Let's go on, Chip. <laughs> <laughs> I, I know your. I got your name down, Pat. Yeah. It is Skip. No, yeah, that's it. No, now I'm confused about Chip, flip, Kip, dip, flip. I'm gonna get it painted on my. Anybody got a marker? <laughs> dip, ship, slip, skip, <laughs> chip. <laughs> Focus right. auto. Hey guys, we're unloaded. <laughs> Here for moral support. I'm here for moral support. Moral support. I'm here for moral support. Moral support. One more time. Dare you, punk. Sweet. Oh, got a lot. I think they're having issues. Oh, yeah. Um, they stanced out. Look at that. <laughs> Look at this thing. Oh yeah. Okay, we're camping. Done. <laughs> Sweet. <clears throat> now, I understand, Josh. It is a Honda. Mm -hmm. But does she have a name? Have you named her? Uh, no. You don't name. Do you name your vehicles? Uh, we were trying to name this one, but my other buddy has a four-seater, and he called it School Bus already, so he can't call it School Bus. You were hoping to go with that one. Yeah. You were Crazy Train. That'd be a what? Who made this? I did. Sweet fist bump. Five pounds of. We got to chug a lug lug and then have a couple of that with some yep. cards. Sweet, you did good. Looks awesome. All right. Let's go see what camp life is inside here. See if that, they say. Well, hello. Uh, surprise. We gotta hurry up and get this done. We gotta go fishing. I gotta take a nap. <laughs> I gotta do. You take a nap. I'm going fishing. Plates. Um, who opened the door? There we go. It's I knew it was haunted. Yeah. <laughs> we in. That definitely smells like a musty camp. It is. Mm. It's also skips musty butt. Ew. Yeah. yeah. Take the poopies. You uh, mean chips? Look at you. Yeah. Um, wow. Yeah. Oh yeah, the burger. I gotta go get that out of the truck so it can go in. Put it in the fridge here. In the fridge. Yeah. yeah. Maybe we'll get it. Got some Sweet. Yeah. I bring it anyways. Just keep on giving. We gotta go. We're gonna check out. Stay. Okay. That fan's not on anymore. What's on? Must have. Oh, so we all. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's backwards. Yeah. So we're gonna hear everyone snoring. Yep. Yep. I don't snore. There's gonna be no sleeping tonight. We're, we, we're better off staying up, That's pulling it. an all-nighter, drinking, playing cards, and going fishing at five in the morning. I think we're better off. No sleep. Yeah. No yeah. sleep. Yeah. That's a great idea. Yeah. yeah. No. Yeah. No. More morning bites just as good as the night. No, it isn't. Not here. It oh, isn't. it's not. Oh, no. oh, you've tried. Yeah. I've, I've gone up to five a.m. and it's night time's the best. Oh. Okay. You can catch a couple in the morning, maybe a couple but, in the evening. But you're better off sleeping and. Enjoying. The evening, like two hours before, they start slapping the water to get hatch. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah. That's a good idea. Yeah. That's a really very, cool. You would know. You've been here every, like every year. So. For ten years. Ten years you've come here, so you know. So this is the good thing. You can roll out of bed and look up. Some propels. No fish. So I roll back. Oh. I go back to bed. Is this like when we went hunting up in Eustis? Yeah. Oh, it's snowing really bad. Oh. Oh, no. I'm going back to bed. You have to go to the uh, the lodge to get bedding. Yes. Yep. That's where I'm going. Well, I, I brought a sleeping no, bag and oh, pillow. Right. They're not here. They're not here yet. You can sleep on the futon downstairs if you want. I brought a sleeping bag and pillow. You guys all brought bed in. Didn't you? No, we're gonna use theirs. Yeah. Oh, okay. I brought just a sleeping bag. And yeah, pillow. they just they called me and said they're not here. They're in Augusta, so when they get back, they come see us. We're okay. So, so it's true. one thirty. Yeah. It's time to go to. No, time to get your stuff ready for fishing because you don't want to be doing it later. Oh, get your okay. leaders on, get your flies on, go check out the water, see what's flying. Oh really? It's yeah. Well, I'm gonna just film, film you tonight. Yeah. All mark maps. 
I'll, I'll, get, I'll still have my stuff ready in case I, I mean, decide. Unless you want to do something else, but I want to try to do a little bit of fishing. Let's go get stuff ready and see what time it is. Yeah. I'm freaking putting flip flops on or something. Oh, yeah. I use my flip flops all the time because you go in and out of your waders that way. Uh, cribbage. Cribbage. Mm -hmm. Well, we're going to give me some drinking and cribbage play. Mm -hmm. These are recycled cards. Though. Recycled cards? Yeah, oh, green. we got to check this out. The green. That eco edition. Mm -hmm. Recycled car, oh, sweet. Yeah, buddy. Appreciate it. <laughs> man, he's just uh, itching to get out. But he, he's got a cameraman now, so he knows he's gonna get some. <laughs> All year yeah. for this. No waiters needed. You don't think? I'm not gonna wear waiters. Oh my god. No, it's too hot for. Too Could hot. you feel the water? <laughs> yep. I fished that. Grab How far it. down and up? out to the middle of this river. And it's mm. up to here. I can almost walk across this whole thing right now. Right here it gets really deep and then... Have, it, you, got, have you gone down and up in places? I've gone down as far as um, the slack water right here. And going up as high as the bridge. Oh, okay. Right here because you have all this rock here. And this is where that guy caught that really nice rainbow. It's right in here. Oh really? So there are some good rainbows. Yeah. Sweet. Yeah, and I, if it's if a cold, if the fish are out biting, you see this is that'd be boiling the fish, like just caught them slapping the water. Oh nice. Yeah. Right now it's probably gonna be pretty black, but they'll come out. You'll be able to get to them at least now too, which is good. I'm actually surprised I haven't seen anything jump yet. Usually they come up during the day too. A couple more hours, I'm gonna start popping up. No bugs really to. You start, you can see the stone flies in the rocks sometimes, the carcasses when they molt. Ooh, grasshopper. Hey, Mark, your hoppers are gonna work. No, uh, gray. There is a bunch of. There's a carcass right there. Stone flies. Yeah, stone fly, huh? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> What's up? Mark, I don't think I'll be able to see. <laughs> well, he's out here with us right now, isn't he? Hopefully the yeah. fishing's good. I thought he was napping. I don't he know. He was supposed to be napping. I don't know about uh, this, the water being this low, if it's going to be great, but... I think... There's about a foot less water than I've seen. This is pretty low. Oh, okay. But, I mean, still the fish, you got to come through here. They'll still fall. come up. North branches really down low. Yeah. Oh, Carabasses. I saw a roll right over there. Did you? There was one out. If you see where those chairs are, he rose yeah. probably about 20 yards up from that bank. And yeah, if you just sit here and watch, you see them. They come right up out of the water. Sweet. But yeah, from that from that canoe, this way, it's all good fishing. There's plenty of room for everybody to go out there and cast out and get a get a good spot. I like fishing out here and fish to this the tail over here. Let my fly float right down in there because they sit. Walk out from over here. Oh yeah, you can walk right out over here. You can't get to the rocks right here, but you can walk pretty much where that canoe is. You can walk almost get halfway, three quarters of the way across the river. It's about right here. But with the water being lower, it might even be better. It might be even farther because they do like the rise out on that side and then they move over to this side. But they were jumping right out that rock face. You'll see them right where that rack is. That little rip right there, you see them whoop, right yeah. on that, and you can't get to it. You can't throw to it, you can't walk to it, and all that's privately owned. You don't let anybody come over there. Yeah. So you have to float down and get on that side if you want to fish that. One guy that used to own the property, he died. The one that used to own that property across to him. We came here one year and we were trying to figure out a way to do it. He's like, hey, just come over and park in my driveway and walk <laughs> across and go fishing. But he passed away and someone else yeah. owns that now. But this is where the, the kayakers come down here, so. Saturday, you're probably going to be inundated with kayakers. I don't know because they might not be able to put in up top because it's so low. And rafters too, I've seen. Uh, what, what rafters? Not much. More like kayakers and canoers come down here. Floaters, they float down. They jump very sporadically down here, but they're in here. Do you use a uh, hopper down here? And there's the slack stuff. They'll hit it. That's where I usually catch them on hoppers. Right there. Damsel flies like uh, damsel or dragonflies. Throw those out. They hit those too. So those around here skimming the top of the box too. Ooh, all 
Hills. I like Hay Hills. I've caught a lot of rock, a lot of them on. The emergers and stuff. Oh, there's some, some coming now, some kayakers. Yeah. They're putting out so that's there. the the cabin literally right there. Yeah. Go fishing. And you're gonna and <laughs> some good fishing too. Yeah, this is good fishing. According to your my best the 10 my years. best year was twenty six trout in two and a half days. Twenty six and yeah. two and a half. That was my what best was year. Biggest? All trout. The biggest is probably eighteen to twenty. Nice. My biggest. All brookies. So they're. I believe they're all brookies I caught. Yep. Nice. But one year I came up here, the water was flooded out past here. I caught two fish above the dam in two and a half days. My average is ten oh, fish per week. Oh, it's too high, too much. Water. Yeah, too much. If water, you want it low, you couldn't get. Because you can't target them, you can't yeah. get right. They're, they're out in the middle, and you can't wait to them. You have to be here with a, a canoe or a kayak. You said you can go out now. You can go. Out. Oh, I think I just saw one. Uh, if you go up here, right here, you're not gonna be able to because this is cut out. But if you go up, you find about 10, 15 yards, you can walk out, you can get halfway, uh, halfway out. You cut out. Just, it's it, well, all the water is rushing here, and it's dug deep. out. It's a deep channel. It starts up here, then. Goes down and then it comes back up again. Just from the years of the water getting right there. You'll see the uh, the uh, gold um, bald eagles and the ospreys will sit it right over here in the morning and they'll wait for fish to come down and hit them. That's always fun to watch. I'll, I think the, I should be able to get some video. The are right down there. What is the pectogriffs? The the, uh, the ones the Indians carved oh, yeah. into the rocks. It's right over there. Oh really? So I can go get some shots of that. Well, you we have to go on the other side of the water. You have to float down and get to it. So oh, it's across the, the river. Yeah. Do you have a bag for that? But I can see them. I can see the white paint from here. I have yeah. GoPros and stuff. I have waterproof cameras. Oh, okay. I guess someone... Well, 20? Normally, normally it's low like this when I come up. It's probably another foot down from when I remember it. An antique Special mark. find. What are you finding? <laughs> it's probably a freaking Mentos or something. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> Oh, that! We're all, we're all looking at this. What, what is, is that? that? Indian ancient, artifact. An ancient pearl? No, it's the fresh made. Has anyone touched, like touched it? No. Have you touched it? Do you dare to touch it? What is that white thing? What if I go home with scurvy? Are you going to touch it? What is it? I have no idea. I don't touch it. Well, what if we poke it? Oh, poke it. What is it? That's a... Is it hot? It's a marble. Oh, it's a marble, a white yeah. marble. It is. Put, yeah. put, it in someone's, put it in someone's bag. Yeah. <laughs> put it in their Skittles bag. <laughs> Rinse it first and it should be flight <laughs> and then stick it in their Skittles bag. Probably. No. Oh, now we can tell them mystery salt. Marble. <laughs> I was kind of thinking along those lines. It was awfully shiny, glossy, shiny. <laughs> All right. Back at the pines. Oh yeah, I don't. Sorry, I don't know. Don't that <laughs> you say you wash your marbles? Yeah. Is it a marble? It's a marble. I, so. I told you it was Indian artifacts. <laughs> Indian, Indian artifacts. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't thing. they play marbles back then? <laughs> they lost their marbles. They're on that. They're on that crazy. <laughs> Really excited because this happens to me the first day I get here. I always get good fish and then it peters out. Hopefully it gets better tonight. I don't know. That was cool. <laughs> I think that one hit the hopper. Are those below the water? The hoppers? Yeah. No, this one's not. I don't know, you might be. Woohoo! Damn it, I'm Oh, you got the hopper. I'm gonna try to take him off without going in the net. The net's gonna mess me up again. Woo! What is that, a bass? No. <laughs> <laughs>
What is it? Hey, Brian. Sure they're not salmon? Look, does it have a split tail? Does it have a V tail? And you won't want to miss the future episodes. So, yeah, subscribe to the Spice Gills YouTube channel if you haven't already, so you won't miss any future uploads. And smash that like button for me too could while you're here that helps boost the algorithm it helps push our videos out there further you know help out the algorithm for the spike skills youtube channel by hitting that like button and subscribing if you haven't already greatly we'd all greatly appreciate the support and yeah so